I'm one of the women who made Arkansas. Um, I was in the Arkansas women's market last year and now I'm here for the virtual experience. I'm originally from Jacksonville, Arkansas. In the last four years, I've lived in Florence, Italy, where I did my MFA in interdisciplinary arts. And let me show you my studio and some of my stuff. Um, interdisciplinary arts was very good for me because I'm all over the place. Of course, being from Arkansas, you got to make stuff with crystals. I have belt buckles and uh, crazy bracelets with teeth, different gems. These will all be for sale, and um, I'm also taking commissions all the time. You want a crazy crown, you want some brass knuckles, come at me. I uh, just wanted to slightly put this stuff out. Here's my prints. Last year, I sold them for two for 50. I'm thinking this year I'll do the same, and so I'll probably just put a couple selections up. They're all on Italian Fabriano paper with homemade metallic inks. Here's kind of just a just paintings that I'm currently working on. Um, I always work on multiple things at once. It helps me with my creativity. And then I just kind of wanted to show my organization skills. I just started a small business about a year ago teaching workshops. I do it through my own site, Eventbrite, and Airbnb. And so I have these organized by the different workshops. So when I have a workshop class, I can just grab it and go. Um, sadly, like all small businesses, I've had to cancel all my workshops and um, it's been really scary and daunting especially for a new business owner and uh, yeah, the, let's hope it gets better. Um, I do a lot of plein air painting mainly to relax. They all have dog hair on them because I have a big white dog running around. Sketching is a big part of my um, process. This is six years worth of sketchbooks. Um, I always have a sketchbook on me. The big guys are like my little tombs and it's nice to have them available for when you don't have ideas. You can go back, look at them, and sometimes it reinvigorates old neurons to be like, whoa, that was a good idea. And um, so I make jewelry. I make prints. I'm a painter. I'm kind of a jack of all trades and a master of none but hopefully maybe comics. Um, I teach comics, I make comics, I have an Instagram Dizzy Comics page that has all sorts of ridiculous stuff, but my main baby is Tex Mexico. Um, this is my graphic novel, and what I would love more than anything else is if you could hook me up with some support on Kickstarter. I started a Tex Mexico Kickstarter page uh, right before COVID, I was supposed to do two Comic Cons, and um, yeah, everything has fallen. So, anyways, this is the book. <laughs> it's 136 pages. I hand inked it, and then I also uh, digitally colored it. And if you go to the Kickstarter Tex Mexico Volume One, you'll see that you can get a book for 20 bucks, 136 page full color book. Or for 60 you can get a book and a cool print, or you can get a cool t-shirt, which I hand printed. So my mom is saying that time is up, and she's doing the roll, roll, roll outside, so thank you very much! 